at Manhattan and I played the iconic role of Elphaba in the West End. So I'm here today to deliver a masterclass to share my experience of what it's like to work in the West End. this job so much and she was warm and she was prepped and she looked gorgeous and she went in and she got cut straight away. I had overslept. I looked like a sack of potatoes. I walked in and I sang Somebody to Love and I sang it how I usually sang it which was the top note just came out raspy and rocky and they said can you just sing that for us again and just make that note clean and I thought 
never been able to do that in my life before. <laughs> That's not how I sing. So I thought, okay, I'll give it a go. And I think it was just adrenaline. It just came out. Do you know who else doesn't um, warm up or think about singing that much? Who? Barbara Streisand. Oh, she's not done too badly, yeah, she? Yeah, yeah. I think there are two types of singers, and I think that there are some who don't think about it at all. And that is that is that works so well because you can just give over to as Barbara Streisand said, she said she follows her bliss through the song. So she just gives in and she follows the song and that's it, oh. done. Um, that's great. As soon as you start thinking, you have to go, I think then there's the other ones who want to know everything, everything that's happening so that they can be in control and that they can work out and they can be um, really, really, they can re really know their instrument. Yeah. But I don't think there's anything in between because when you start thinking, even the smallest thing, if you start to sing, uh, sing and you think, uh-oh, you know, what's going to happen? You might tighten your jaw, which is going to just tighten everything up, mm. and it's going to cause so much. So we either need to just, we kind of also need to have a hat. Are you one of those who's going to go with emotion and um, instinct, or are you one of those ones who wants to know about it? So I think what we're going to do is we're going to, today, we're going to do technical knowledge, listening and copying, and emotion. And some of these will work for you, and some of them won't work for you. So I've tried to create in our warm-up five exercises that incorporate a bit of technical knowledge, a bit of listening and copying, and a bit of using emotion. So hopefully one bit will work for you. They've got their own um, nerves in them. You can't control them yourself. They happen as a result of other things around them. Um, they hate to overfire. When they overfire, they lock and cramp and they want to be like elastic bands, yeah. um, or, or they want to be elastic. They're, they're a mixture of muscle, mucosa, and ligament. But they want to be supple, and they want to be moving from high notes, which are long and thin, to low notes, which are short and fat. They want to be able to be doing that, and if they fire, they lock, and you, you're gone. That's it, you can't sing. Now, every time you're about to hit a high note, you did that, which... <laughs> It was, it was not quite like that. It was much cooler than that. But every time you did that, when you threw your hand, it was proper. It wasn't a, like a place. It wasn't a. It was a proper throw in your arm. I think that was just letting everything release. For That's me, exactly. once I knew that I'd kind of tick the box of okay, I've done a bit of technique and I've got that into a safe place and I'm not doing myself any damage. Now I can let the emotion come through. And once I knew, because my biggest bugbear is going to watch shows. I'm going, oh yeah, they look really lovely and it sounds beautiful, but I, they're dead behind the eyes. Technically, it's a perfect performance. I would rather hear somebody's emotion coming through and a crack and a, you know, a break in the voice where it's coming from an emotional place and it's imperfect, but you believe them, mm. as opposed to a technically perfect performance. And there's a difference between watching and going, oh, Oh, that doesn't sound safe. <laughs> That's different. Yeah. What I mean is that you trust that they know their instrument, but they are they are emoting through their voice. They are singing. They're following that bliss, whatever that yeah. is. As opposed to, I've been to see so many shows, and I'm like, yeah, beautiful voice. Did not move me in the slightest. Because for me, the reason I sing is about connection.
was like strained and raspy and had this kind of like if we were rocky it was that kind of I think oh, and I was like no this is not good and then my voice would feel tired yeah. and sore and, and that's the trouble because it's that whole like it's a circular thing isn't it yeah. you sing wrong and then it gets you lose your voice and it yeah. gets wrong. You sing right, I do believe you can sing in your shows. Twenty yeah, shows. And, and I used to find that actually I, I was a bit of a freak, but by show seven, I was like Yeah. I was cooking on gas. Yeah. I was like <laughs> show eight, I was like, Oh we've got to finish now because I felt really yeah. strong. That and then sense. you take the day off and then you come back on the Monday and it was like you were having to start it was like going to like base camp and having to <laughs> climb it. Deliberated over for probably years and years and years. Why do we put this in? Will this work? Will that work? It's time to trust my instincts. Like your job is to make sure that your diction is strong enough that without it feeling like you're going to, you know, trust my instincts. It's not Shakespeare, but it's about giving it the give it the weight that it deserves. And, and just as Rachel was saying, you know, the rules of someone else's game. It's like. It's a thought. She's she's working it out as she's seeing it. But when she says it's time to trust my instincts, it's like, no, this is this is actually the most honest and authentic thing that's going on in this whole situation. Oh, what? So, hey, 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 hey.